talents towards this A-side. Two defenders on that A-side here from the side of Damwon. And the quick dash in from SK Rossi gets the opening pick on the UG. And Dexter will be able to hold him back for the meantime. Can he find a follow-up? He finds a double dashing in the short and he gets that one. Will not be able to get any more as Hellranger and Skills clean up the site. I am... How did Dexter get from back site to yeah. short? In the blink of an eye, probably a dash, but that was very quick. I like the positioning. He didn't want to play for hell because he knew that he was going to get overwhelmed by the rest of the members that Global Esports was just coming in to push. Uh, Spike has been planted. Hell Ranger, more of a crossfire error than anything with the utility, but as his fault line does come back off cooldown, this is where perfectly they'll be able to set up the fight against the retakers. Now, Damwon gonna have to just try to isolate some couple of fights here all up into the air for secret and we'll see if the secret is out or is it going to be kept as uh, skills as well as the sofa will be in this two versus one he's way out into the open and you sure be damn well known uh, and this is my point already global esports kind of figuring this out immediately go for the b site and i like this they still are on a bonus round they have the specters in tow and making sure that everything is just working up for them is going to be good that was an amazing flash but dolu an amazing sucker or sorry gravity weller <laughs> nonetheless john high last person standing in global east paul you got sri lanka maldives bangladesh pakistan lots of very big regions and so they are very experienced in these type of fights, and Hell Ranger will continue to rain hell here now on the sea site this time after that breach comes on in. They now have the site fully taken, given away here by DK. They know the WG Kia. They cannot continue to contest this, so the retake is going to have to come in from them. Not a single ultimate up online as we're in round 5 already here for Damwon, and this is not looking too good for them, especially after the opening pick found here by Global. It's all about that retake. Cloudburst comes in, gives a bit of solace for Texture, but the crossfire good with Golu and his teammate. They know he's in the back of the site. They're making some damage happen. Okay, they're, they've kind of thinned down the herd, but the big problem is there is going to be Hellranger plus Kappa, who is holding this nice little... Uh, hallway down on sea long they're popping shots they're hearing it but they're seeing the peaks and nobody is on the spike and this not the ages like but the map select overall yeah. i feel like it really favors global esports because i think that they're a team that might just want to always play in tighter corners and it kind of shows especially with hell ranger being very very good on his breach and as i mentioned it Ah, Caster's Curse, always a uh, fair mistress. Texture's gonna be able to hit a couple of shots. Right click will not be able to refresh because it doesn't get a kill, and uh, obviously this new patch. Golu's gonna have to go in wild in SK Rossi. What are you doing, man? I mean, they did for one round, but not really anymore. Setups on the Astra is good to block the vision, but not really block the bullets. And Hell Ranger, he's got to be careful in trying to plant the spike down, as there is the Hunter's Fury trying to tag him in. Yeah, he might not kill him on the third one, but he's got to be careful as someone might actually come in and just spray mow him down. Five to one, one minute. There's time to breathe. SK Rossi, he's heard the Cypher Cam, so what's the adjustment here? Seems like this is going to wait a little bit. As now his location has been exposed and I just have no idea what happened. That, this that is awesome. where things are going to come down to the wire and you, look at this. Damwon, they just clean up how... See that uh, drone oh. utilized. They just go in uh, quickly Ow. charge into the site. Eugene's going to have to back away for the moment, but he's already done some damage. He's Planted. kind of forced the spike to be planted on the god spot. You should this actually help out Global Esports, who is looking to mm. delay it even further with a Killjoy ultimate being active right now. This is going to buy so much time and damn one. They're going to be left scratching their heads what they're going to have to do after the duration of that ultimate. Yeah, the smokes are going to keep him at bay as well. No more shock darts here to destroy that, but the recon bolt is up online. Information to be given away by that aftershock is going to be huge. Jiang He, he finds that kill here. SK Rossi, big player to get taken down. Gol is able to find one in the Eugene, and he's going to find a second. Oh. Global Esports completely rounding this out, and down one are going to give it up. They're going to go and save the weapons as Global take a sixth round on the board here right now to make a play, and that they could maybe do here. Okay, that shock dart is going to land perfectly and doing so much damage here on him. And now Secret is going to have to fall back as Zhang Hai taking out trade here by SK Rossi. Rossi, he was cycling weapons. Oh, no, no, no. You do not do that to intro. You just do not. And oh. intro. He has a I don't know, man. There have been some rounds where due to timing, they have just lost their lives. But, I mean, it won't be too hard to uh, retake here, I'd say, especially when Golu's been knocked off his block with that stun from the Trailblazer. 
and that is going to be a golden anchor to site. So the retake is going to have to come to happen, but it's been very difficult for them to actually retake the site here. Eugene though finds an opening pick, and that is huge for them to find skills. Now they can potentially flood this site, dropping down. SK Rossi finds the one with a double trade here. Come from Andro, he finds a double kill. SK Rossi finding a double of his own, and they will be able to shut him down. The triple kill now for SK Rossi. Intro with a triple of his own. He has the Odin in hand, could potentially lay the smackdown on them with this big LMG. But it's down to SK Rossi versus Intro. Here comes now the Nero Thaf, and he peeks, and he gets the clutch as well. Intro, a 4K for him. And let's see now if this will be able to get them the tie at the end of the half. SK Rossi, he's uh, kind of threading on thin ice here. Getting double pinged by the recon is going to be quite brutal for him. Texture's been tagged down, knocked away. Sight's still open, but Eugene is holding a nice little angle here. The stun will connect. Never no. mind! It was just a pixel angle for him. There's a teeny tiny bit on Graffiti that kept him safe. And now he has not intro. Intro here with him to steal up the rest. Actually, everybody from Dawan has joined the party, has joined the fight. And it's a two versus four. Uh, Smackdown between Global. This smoke creates no. some smoke criminal placements from Golu, and we'll see if he can make this happen. He's severely outnumbered here, Black, but he's created some space on uh, on Long, and he does have the spike in hand. But he seems to want to fight for the A side, not go to anywhere else. Teammates can come in and start rotating. Speaking of coming in, it's going to be DK's texture who just comes through the crossfire. The cross no. the classic. Sometimes it's a laser, other times it's a pea shooter. In this case, the latter falls true, but he's able to get the kill here on Zhang Yi. He knows that the rest is here towards mid and global. This should be a pistol round for them. Very off kilt or off kind of action. He's just about to get a surprise. It's not even Christmas. But his opponent is still kind of hovering somewhere underneath window. He's hearing a lot of footsteps. One more rotation and that's going to be it. Oh, he's just about to get caught. Oh, unfortunate. Kappa. Leaving him there to delay. Really good decision. But Chong he yeah, no uh, spike in hand. He's had to pick it up. 20 seconds. I don't think he's going to be able to make this happen. I don't think so either. And I don't believe that Damwon are playing this right, to be quite honest with you. You give up the opening pick, you're down the man, and then you dig here. They've got the flashes, they've got the breach really oh up and close. God. And you're looking at them, but Kappa! A triple kill for him! He completely shreds him down on A main! And if it's, it's a slaughter here, annihilation from the side of Global, and Damwon are shook pace it seems to might have worked but i told you black they need that explosiveness and everybody's setting up this does not help their case global they're all about the chaos they're all about those aggressive little but this is where it becomes very tricky for damn one they've all but rotated onto the c site but they have to peek every single corner intro's gone in wild here they've activated the jellyfishes and it seems like that one they're making this work sk rossi he only has an operator when everybody's just chiming in on his position peppering it with bullets and now well that one it seems like they might be able to pick this one back up now that uh yeah it's only hell ranger to remain Late round push here works out for Damwon. That's exactly what they needed so desperately. And there should be a seventh round on the board for them. Honestly, this is going to be their first round that they've won this entire half. And Hell Ranger landing that shot, but the crossfire not. Are you going to be the wind beneath my wings? SK Rossi, he wants to challenge once again, and he don't miss. He kind of covered the lid on the rest of the side here. And SK Rossi, he knew that he was spotted on Garage. It's a common tactic with Jet players go to a different site and, well, his read perfect and his peak even more pristine. Three versus five black and the chances of uh, DK here, DWG, excuse me, slowly dwindling down after each takedown. This is not looking too good for them, to say the very least. You know, SK Rossi opened things up and the skills chimes in for another frag and now Damwon down to just two players remaining. This is looking like a potential global esports map. And that is certainly looking to be the case as Eugene goes down. It's all on a secret here. And there is nothing, no stones unturned. They know where he is. Smoke will let him get some bit, but they pull that back immediately, giving him a false sense of security. Global have match point and potentially map one. I'm shuddering in my 
uh, in my spot here. Not because the AC is like right behind me on full blast, but get that dub. And yeah, you said it already. Golu, also known as Lightning Fast, also going to be playing here in mid, the sneaky beaky spot. But I'm not sure if he's going to be able to make this work or somebody will flush him out. Either way, let's see. This could be disastrous here for Damwon if they're not able to find him, if he's continuing to remain and do this. SK Rossi finds a, do finds a pick as Golu finds another here. Secret, he was holding the angle but still gets caught off guard. Eugene, almost a second too late. He does get that down and Texture is able to get the trade off here. 2v3, still an opportunity for Damwon to stay alive in map number one. But it's going to be very difficult, especially with SK Rossi still up online with that operator. You're going to have to play together. Dash is up online for Texture, but what will it really matter? 30 seconds left in the clock. They have to pick a site. It seems like they're going for the C site, maybe trying to go through a garage where SK Rossi is waiting for them at the perfect opportunity. As soon as they peek out of the garage and in the C site, they're going to have to deal with a sniper at the gates, and that is going to be SK Rossi himself. Can they actually force him out here? He has a dash to maybe shake things up, but they have very little time to work with. 13 seconds is not a whole chunk, and... You know, SK Rossi, he's used the ability that all Asian mothers want to have. It's the wash dish. Yeah, that's denied it. That's going to be in GG. Oh, no, no time. There's three people. <laughs> no way. No scope. Bye. Damn one. Trying to force things up here, trying to take matters into their own hands, and Intro is able to find one. The dink here has been given to SK Rossi, down to 11 HP. It seems for the most part that Damwon are looking quite successful right now. In the meantime, as SK Rossi eventually goes down, Eugene finding a double Hell Ranger, two big pickups for the side here now of Damwon Gaming. And Global seem to have been shaken, shook, and stirred by this force buy from Damwon. That was just unfortunate. I, I'm pretty sure they didn't expect the force fight to come through and definitely caught them unawares. Golu's gonna have to try. But, but now, Damwon on the A side attack. Locked down here to give him some space, but SK Rossi finding the pickoff on the secret. A double from him! This is huge! This is working out! He's almost able to find the triple, but eventually shut down now. Three versus three, no weapons in the size of global, but they've made it quite expensive for the meantime, taking that operator out of their hands, and they can now finally get the plant Asurai. I think it was the panel that also mentioned that if you're up against an operator, you just have to have that sacrificial lamb. Literally just that one guy and everybody can just rush right in. And again, let's, the rest of Global do not have the weapons to literally make this possible. It is going to just go down to the wire. Hell Ranger only the frenzy in hand. We'll see if the flash that he did will actually net the damage. He splashed the last guy. He know where it is. No and does he have it in him? Oh my goodness. Hell Ranger, are you kidding me? The Global have been really good and proficient at. Can they actually check him out? Oh, but with the judge, the jury's out on that. Execute is his call. And <laughs> Eugene will get that kill finally. But right to a 4v4. Have some time to work with. But SK Rossi on this off is not going to land the shot. A very crucial one for him to land. They do get the kill on the skills. And they do get the plant down as well. Great shot by Eugene to bring it back. Oh, man. SK Rossi is just not having a fun time with this operator. Oh. And Secret lines up the shot beautifully. We saw last round, you know, Hellranger clutch it out. Can Kappa do the same? He's getting pop shot it in. Yeah. That one are set up. Global are set up to hold that A. And Rossi finds a frag here in the Jong. He's trying to be sneaky, but not enough. What? What? Wait, they detained three players? Oh, yeah. Texture's about to go in and play his game of whack a mole. Let's see if he can actually whack anybody from Global Esports here. Seems like that's going to be a no. Maybe just on Jonghee, but that's actually, no, 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 that was that one's player. Never mind, what am I talking about? Rossi, though, he's kind of come in through top mid. A bit too greedy on his part, as his teammates were nowhere near the site to kind of help him out uh, pinch the rest of the members here. But there's a cosmic divide that we're at from the last round. Kappa's going to be coming in from heaven here. They're trying to isolate the fights. Recon Dart to expose things up, but the follow-through from Global is just a bit lacking. Here comes Hell Ranger though, one in front, one behind. Can he try to go about it? And Eugene making it happen for the meantime. Look at this aggression here comes from both teams. The mid link is where the battle will go down. It's going to be a complete chaos here on that mid link position, trading out one for one. Not a direct trade, but a trade nonetheless. Four versus four. They are going to be just trying to go around his skills. He's he spotted a bit of a target there on top mid. That's going to at least kind of collapse the rest of Damwon to be just in the center of the A site. But this is still going to be a very, very difficult task. <laughs> That's over drone. Texture is going to be just a surprise at the side. 
Kappa? Yeah, you know what he is. He's just waiting for no. it. No! No! Kappa! You don't do this! Okay, it's still not done. Oh my god. But skills is here. 1v1. He has the Phantom now, Black. He knows it's out in the open. This is actually winnable for no him. Never way. mind. Two versus one. And free way of losing your life. In game. By far not. Oh, oh no. SK Rossi. Yeah, it's either he got it at minus one. If, you know, if they read the situation right. Which they did. That one in. Bringing a knife to gunfight. It happens. Hell Ranger, good pick off on Eugene. Trying to cross and get the spike down, but. We've talked about how, okay, they get these opening picks, but then again, they've been failing to convert some of them, which you would think, like the last round right prior. But look at this. He's already crawled out to the very far edge of that heaven here, Skills, and the Cosmic Divide should give him some space to work with, but Skills will be able to find one texture, finding a double kill here. It's all on the Hell Ranger. He's got the nerve plate. Ah, and an Ninjago is the leg of her. Drink. Very true. Yeah. Rossi, though. Aggression from him. Punished by Secret. Intro doing the same thing. Golu able to find a double with a Spectre? That somehow works out for the Damn decent when they're up against Global, who has been technically manhandling them uh, during that last uh, particular map of ours. A couple of uh, utilities being used. That Recon Dart got a lot of value. It spotted so many of them, but Trexter spotting even more so. What? His opponents are just coming in one after the other. He fought. Could be actually be A. Here. Well, they still have three players stacked up on there. A setup here, defensive setup by Global. And that shock card is perfect to try and clear some of that out. SK Rossi, an opening pick. He finds a double, not able. Actually, he does. He is able to back off here. Texture not able to take him down. Zhang He will find skills at the other edge of it. And Texture has an idea that SK Rossi has crossed on over. Here comes the Rolling Thunder, though. And that's going to be so detrimental. Texture has to find a way to back on off. And that he goes into hell. And can he send even more? Hell Ranger will find him very aptly named. And SK Rossi here the blades a triple kill for him intro it's all left on him as out the lockdown will not come in, in time to force him off the defuse yes it does that's a perfect nick of things and he's able to deny that but does he know sk rossi's bad he whips the right click and he gets it with a classic anyways they get the round market but the rest of the players are kind of lurking towards that a site the spike is dropped further away and sk rossi will get the kill here in a jong high that is a huge pick from them, but intro with that Odin able to get the kill. Quick trade off from Skills, and he's looking to find and dip even into more. Skills, the perfect poison spot if somebody comes through mid, but well, they doubled back. SK Rossi Ten has to go left. for the dash. Unfortunately, he's not going to be able to get the first One hit. Second remaining. will not be followed to follow through, but Skills. He's poison Last spotting this. Even if he standing. loses, there's no time for them to get the plant on the spike. Kappa, all he needs to do now is wait, wait, wait for the train. Of course, there are some Astro Stars that's going to block his vision out, but there's the standard start. Good use on the dash, but Texture as well as Secret, they've kind of perf all on the defender's spawn, but somebody's marking his position. He spams it hard with the classic, gets it back into cover, and they've kind of isolated this. If he can take down Secret, this turns into a very viable uh, round for Global. Yeah, I mean, Kappa is quite low, but they can find skills, and maybe this still could be a round that they can bring back into. Right. Skills has that information, knows where Intro is, but Secret gets a kill on the Kappa. The low player already taken down. Intro is low himself, and if he doesn't go down here, which he doesn't, Secret able to back away. He's actually incredibly low, looking to have his teammate kind of help him out here, and they kind of just hold the angle on the doorway, and it's working. It's working quite fantastically. Skills now kind of dips into the, in terms of the kills. He has... What was... Okay, I thought that was going to be a headshot or something. Skills comes through the smoke. SK Rossi... Well, he's trying to get some foothold on A main. Because his teammates are about to explode on short. They do have Golu who is going to be catching off here. But SK Rossi, he charges in without any... Actually, any form of cover from his teammates. He's just a bit too far forward there. Left. And now they know that short is kind of exposed a little bit, but Texture and the rest of that one, they were very much prepared for that. So, Global Esports, the thought problem even, but when there's a little bit more, a lot more angles actually to try to deal with here, especially on Ascent, it might not be the easiest thing for them, and Texture doesn't even need to. And that kind of pulled the rotation back, but now you can see Texture is going back towards that top mid on the CT spawn. But the Lurk here from Golu could be influential. Pull will delay them time, 30 seconds, actually less than that remaining on the clock, and if Global can open up the site, they could pull out the thrifty one, but Texture has something to say about that. A triple kill for him, and Eugene gets the fourth. Golu, Herculean tap. 
actually be good because now they have good control of short. Mm. Dexter though, hits a shot. That uh, might not be what they were looking for. Hell Ranger, the balls on this man. Down to five. He's uh, at least equalized to the four versus four. Ironclad stature for the man, but he's down to 5 HP, so single bullet will do him on, and then they line up for him! That's what's happening! have a chance to bring it as it goes to a 2v3, but here comes a recon out. Ultimate's up on line for Zhang Yi here. Now they know that he's there, and Gold is able to find the double! That's exactly what they needed to bring it to a 2v2, but Texture gets Kappa down. 1v2 right now, it's all in the Golu, the ring is his if he can claim it for himself, but Texture is holding on to heaven here. He's doing a great job of keeping him at bay, not gonna let him walk on through. As his cosmic device is going to expire, oh, 10 no. seconds left on clock, has to go for the plan. He does not know he's in Jenny, but oh. Golo makes it happen! A 4 kill for him! Quad! And he gets him! What? How many seconds do we have there, Black? I was looking at- 6 I was seconds? One second, people. Oh my goodness! And a nice edge here, Black. They do not want to fall to the Talked about how 6 rounds, very difficult, but ahead. they're making it happen. SK Rossi, though. He's really had no luck at all with the Operator versus Operator fight, but maybe his teammates can bring it all the way back. Especially in this attack, it has been faltering for him. Now, Intro has a great spot to deny this, but Eugene, look at that help from him. Keeping the line held, and Intro finds another. It's all down to Skills, who finds a double kill, but Eugene, very risky. If Skills doesn't time this correctly, he's gonna get pop shot it, and he's fine. Nope. Never mind, three versus three. 3 versus 3 here, the retake is going to come in from Damwon, they got some utility workers, but that flash will dispense. They got the initiator and the duelist here to try and aggress onto this, but Skills is doing a great job of forcing them back with those blast packs. The smoke will give them a bit more holding power here, as now Damwon are a bit afraid to try and rush into that site. Skills has been given away, Golo finding the pick, Hellranger doing the same, and Golo's going to confirm big, because Killjoy, with her utility, has a lot of presence there. Texture! Oh, oh no way! Just... Timing once again, he looked to the left as soon as he got dropped down from the right. That's gonna be yeah. another good round for Blue. On split for those opening halves, maybe they can turn things around once we go later into it, but he actually stuns his own teammate. In SK Rossi, very dangerous his position is right now, not able to land that shot as John I. Perfect help here coming from Intro, even while kinda blind, he still gets that. The triple kill now goes in the way of Dam 1, and this could be their first round of the map. It's like that jigsaw puzzle where you think that the piece is the one that's there to kind of fit in and then it just doesn't as you try to push it into that. It's literally that. It felt like there's just so much good things that is happening there for Global, but it just did not kind of mesh well all together. There still is a... And openly, information given away. They know where he is going for those jump peaks just to keep him off guard and now Texture will get the final kill. Right? The big problem to that okay. was... <laughs> I'm getting hyper by the coffee, all right? But yeah, again, the big problem to that was because he was so far forward, teammates was just not able to kind of follow through. Speaking of follow through, here comes the satchel charge. We'll see if it's better this time. And that one hit the center stage or the center fold. SK Rossi got to whip up the weapon, but Secret still finds the kill. Flash on out. They've traded each other now. Four to four on the peak. Skills punished. I think that was a bit overzealous there. Over eager for him to go and peak that smoke without even having a flash to help him. Rolling thunder on out, but that's not really going to do much. The lockdown will buy them some space to work with. In global, they found the pick off here in Eugene, but intro is going to do the same. To Kappa does get Golo. It's all on the Hell Ranger in a one v three. We've seen him pull out incredible clutches. It pulls him into the fray. Secret not able to get the half, and this is huge now coming from Hell Ranger, but no more stars for him to light up the sky. Intro can now stick the defuse. He gets the down on the texture and Hellranger down to a single HP. Oh now playing this one perfectly, biding his time. He knows he has to push this and that he does! Hellranger getting! People are able to make that happen. It's going to be quite difficult. Skills now using the smoke to try to scurry his way in, but Jagolu holds on. They know they have the numbers, but Golu could be in a bad cheeky spot. Second will not commit. Wait! Texture! Where did he get the kill on Hell Ranger? Oh, they lined up for him. They must have lined up, but Global still bring it back. An ascent, but I feel like Split not really the map for Ops. We'll see if he can make it work though. That slow orb has advantages, and that could be the case once more. Here. Smoke will give them some alleyway texture, landing the shot on the Hell Ranger. Not a difficult one, but an important one to land. An intro will get the follow up. 2v5. If they lose this, then I don't know what else they can do, but this should be a round that they secure, and that they're very close to doing. Kappa 
still not spotted that flash did not actually give his location away but regardless five versus one a better case for it. and damn one have put themselves into this risky spot and make it work but speaking of risky sk rossi he lives for the danger this man's a daredevil but this daredevil has been shut down although g skill or ge skills able to pick up the kill to equalize to the four to four He's still walking through it, breaks down the wall, the melt of it as it comes up and up, and the res here coming from Secret as well. UG can potentially use that to bait them into a position, and they now know that Heaven has been controlled by Global, but this also gives him some actually uh, staging ground to try and counteract this. Intro landing that kill, falling on back to pull the defense, the offense rather, even further. Great Nano Swarm is going to push through it. Skills punished, going way too over eager there, hunting for the frag. Hell Ranger, look at this. He's just playing within Trigger Discipline, lets him walk on by. They confirm that kill, getting one, getting a second on that spray transfer, but not much more. And looking into that ult economy black, four big ones. <laughs> Make it three big ones for uh, oh. for Global here. But when it's down Rossi, and that's all in the Hell Ranger going Kappa. Cosmic Divide out on. This is the last round of the half, so this is the time to use it. They still have the Neural Theft here. Which could be huge as soon as they get a pick off, but they're gonna have to find that pick to be able to even use that ultimate. Lockdown here will buy them some space, but they have to be careful because as it comes on out, they get it destroyed, which is very good for them. Good aftershock, but Cosmic Divide has expired. There's gonna be a big flank from intro, but oh, Golu, no he's opening things up, this Cosmic Divide! Able to actually divide the fights here, and it's working. Golu, he's picking up all the kills, and damn one, they but all but lost this. Oh, that's no on the top of the heavens. Jonghee left oh into my. a three versus wish out already in global on market, and they can hit one on secret. And skills, smooth criminal to be able to get the headshot and just mamba out four to five at the rest of the round. Very nice controlled aggression here from the side of Global. They realize B main is quiet and so they push that lane to maybe find an opening and that they do. SK Rossi here finding Eugene and this is looking very dire right now for Damwon. I said, you know, if you are in a very good spot to retake this site. They might have actually even given up the site or given up for the plant just so that they know that there's one at least onto the site. That tripwire does not help the case of Damwon at all. But maybe the fadeaway shot from Jonghee would be enough. Texture is down to 13. His teammate's gonna get stunned. He's coming out, spotted immediately, and it's all down to intro. But maybe he can isolate the fights. It was just a maybe. It's not really gonna happen. That's gonna be 10 to 3. And I'm pretty sure going into the next round, at least with the spike beetles, but could be palatable right now. Although, Damwon, that's right, going towards the A site, and this might not work out for him. They've lost SK Rossi, but at least for this particular map, it ha he hasn't been the star of the show. I think it's been Hell Ranger as well as skills that really have kind of created the, the space for them. Hell Ranger, sneaky boy, able to use the smoke to deceive that nobody was on the A side, but then boom, gives some uh, free space, safe space to push in onto the B side. But they're scrambling. They're losing a lot of map control here, and skills has spotted Intro, who is trying to be sneaky beaky onto the side itself. That's going to be only Jonghee to remain. He's going to be picking up onto the Phantom. It's a three versus one. He has to go crazy on that spray down. Not really. Uh, uh, some reinforcements here, Black. And Ranger, he still wants to go for the fight, and well, he's going to be chewing through this as his teammate blinds the rest of the opposition. And DK, they're, DWG, excuse me, they're pushing to go for this. People are on B Heaven already. I'm not sure why Intro was clearing that so deep alone. His teammates were near, but not near enough to immediately trade. And just misplay after misplay here coming from down one especially. They've kind of encapsulated the site right now and Dexter is able to get that rotation around and get the flank. They could pin Sir Hell Ranger here and that's oh, exactly what they nice. do. Three versus two right now. They picked up some Spectres and they have a chance, an opportunity here to turn this around. But the double spray down coming from SK Rossi brings it to a 1v1. Golu with a Phantom is more than... It's not bursting. Global trying to break through as the uh, aggressive Rapids. But Damwon's uh, defenses, or rather offense, is holding... A bit true here, Black. A bit true. Throws out the trigger onto that uh, onto that ultimate of his, and can the Rolling Thunder actually make it happen for for them? Golu! Oh, oh, never mind! A crossfire is beautiful for Global. Completely shutting them down, and so are the hopes.
Odin Dreams now of Dam 1. 20 seconds left on the clock. That isn't much time to work with. Texture, they've found out where he is. He's got blades, but can that be enough for him? Going to the back of the side, getting that dash on. It's a 1v3. He shut down and glow.